Nobody told me we were taking the scare aptitude test today. How can I study for the SATs if nobody tells me? You didn't study? Yeah. Ah, the element of surprise. That's what makes the scare aptitude test scary. So, for my first victim, uh, I mean test taker, I choose you. Now, scare me. Call that scary? Try this. Still time to cram. Let's see. Scary noises. Boo! No. Wa ha 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 ha! Cram all you want, mummies boy. It still won't help. But here's the good news. Your dog sends you his love and kisses. <laughs> <laughs> You're opening up people's private mail? Give that to me. <laughs> Ooh. And here's one for Casper. Maybe it's from his uncles telling him how much they love him. Badge, could I have my letter? Sure, right after I read it. Hey! Give me that! Oh, no! All right, who scared that gargoyle? Not me! Them! Really? Well, then. <laughs> the four of you just passed the scare aptitude test. <gasps> but it was Thatch. What he means, sir, is thank you. Now, we've got to go. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> we passed, and we didn't have to scare anyone, huh, Casper? I don't believe this. According to this letter, Jimmy is... That's right. I'm moving far away. My dad wants to make a fresh start. That's right. There are no good sales jobs left here in Deeds. Who were you talking to? Just myself, Dad. Attaboy, son. You'll need to learn to entertain yourself where we're moving. Fort Unnecessary, a town without any modern day conveniences. Think of all the things I can sell there. I'll make a killing in air fresheners. Now let's get packing. Is he gone? He's gone nutso, if you ask me. And look, there's the real estate agent who's gonna sell our house. I'm doomed! You're less doomed than you think. Yeah! Casper told us about the letter, and we're here to help. All we have to do is scare the buyers away, and you won't have to move. <sighs> Wolfie, you're on. And it's such a darling neighborhood. <laughs> and uh, pet friendly, too. Uh, now let's go inside. Quickly! <laughs> I really don't think that scaring people is the way to go here. Sure it is. We just need to ramp it up a little. The paint in here is so delightfully, uh, retro. Brains must eat brains. Oh. What was that? That's, uh, brains. that's the surround sound. <laughs> Incredibly lifelike, isn't it? <laughs> <gasps> <laughs> so, what do you say? Sign here and we'll make this baby yours. Then I can go home and have a heart attack. I don't get it. Why hasn't she run away screaming? I hate to do this, but it's time to try the direct approach. Hi. Look, can I ask you please not to buy this house? See, it belongs to my friend Jimmy. Ah! Ghost! Ghost! You horrible thing! I almost had the sale. <laughs> hey, lighten up, Casper. Now Jimmy's dad can't sell the house, so he has to stay in Deed's town. I know, but... Guys, I'm stuck. Where's that real estate agent? What was that? Something weird is going on around here. Uh, you were looking for the real estate agent? She said something about quitting. Really? Fine. 
I'll sell this house myself. Just have to get my lucky salesman shoes out of the closet. No, Dad! Ah, there we go. Wait a minute. Something's wrong here. Good as new. <sighs> that was close, but it still looks like Jimmy's moving. So plan A didn't work, or plan B. Lucky for us, I've got a plan C. When people come to buy your house at 118 Willow Avenue... Brilliant! Except, won't they keep looking for 118? Mantha says she's got that under control. Sirs, we know how hard you work. So we all chipped in and got you your own vacation house. It's pitiful. Where are the towers? The moat? If you don't like it, I guess we could give it to Frank and Jim teacher. We'll, we'll take, take it. it. I get the bigger bedroom. Idiot. One eighteen. This must be where the open house is. It worked. Ah, just one tiny problem. Look where they're headed. What's that? Hey, look. That house says 118. Yep, 118 Willow. Oh, no. Come in. No pushing. Have your checkbooks ready. So, this is it. Moving day. Looks like we blew it. Not necessarily. But Dad sold the house. The moving men are here. True, but if the movers can't move anything, you'll have to stay, right? Now here's the plan. Ah! What's going on? I thought I put those in the... Thanks, guys. <coughs> now to unpack. Great work, Mantha. Hey, this might actually work. Oh, I know what's going on here. You do? You're trying to jack up your rates, moving boxes back and forth instead of into the truck. Well, from now on, I'm watching every box. Nothing's gonna get past me. Hey, my arms. Guys, get back here. Okay, that's everything. Close her up and move her out. Uh-oh! Thanks, Wolfie. So that's it. I'm really moving. Unless I can scare those movers away before they start the truck. You'd really scare someone? For me? Looks like I don't have a choice. Hey, wait! Hey! <laughs> oh! A ghost? It's okay, Casper. You tried. I'm sure gonna miss you. I'll protect you, Jimmy. Go away. Shoo! Shoo! I'll see you later, Jimmy. <laughs> wow! Did you see that? A real ghost! And I got rid of him. I guess we should get going. Going where? This has given me a great idea. So you're 
not moving? Nope. After Dad scared you off, he realized there's a great business opportunity right here in Deedstown. Got ghosts in your garage? Poltergeists in your parlor? Not after you call Brett Bradley, the only official ghost catcher in Deedstown. Cool. Uh-oh. Out of the way, son. I think we got one. There's something ghostly in the Anderson house, son, and I'm gonna track it down. Aren't Alder and Dash in there? How dare you interrupt bath time! Out of our house, Flashy! I think I taught them a lesson. There goes the neighborhood. You may think fleshies are easy to catch in winter because they're wearing so many clothes. Let's find out. On your marks. Casper, no flying. Get set. Scare! Help! Creatures! Help! Creatures! Oh, I forgot to tell you! I covered the floor with ice! Everything about winter stinks. Except the winter chill dance. Okay, except for that. Could somebody get me some warm water? Or I'm gonna be stuck here till spring. Oh. Hey, Monica, you going to the winter chill with anyone? That depends. So you wanna go with me? <gasps> nope, sorry. <sighs> what was that all about? It's just a dance. It's not just a dance. It's choosing a queen. Dummy girl. Hmm. I don't see her as queen material. Bra, king and queen of the chill, that's just this goofy thing we do to make the dance more fun. You don't understand. I come from a long line of kings, but I never got to be one. This is my one chance. It's this or nothing. Hey! Mantha, can I measure your head? Get away from me! I'm going to the dance with Casper! Mickey, is your head bigger than Monaco's? She always says so. How'd you like to be my queen for the winter chill? I'd love to be a queen. Great. We'll just have to make a few changes to how you look and act, okay? Ah. Posture, more scary. Makeup, more gruesome. Now, about the way you dress. Ow! Ah. What? <sighs> what? Guess what? I volunteered us to judge the dance. Where was I when you did that? It was your day off. The winning couple gets to be king and queen of the school for a month. And we get to tell everyone else they lost and have to do everything the winners say. <laughs> I didn't mean to hurt her feelings. If you keep this up, you won't be going with anyone. Harpy, <gasps> you're the only girl who hasn't signed this petition. We refuse to go to the dance with Ra due to his recent rude and insulting behavior. Mantha! How's it going? I saw you ten minutes ago. So, what's new? <gasps> Harpy, will you go to the winter chill with me? Please? <gasps> you would have had more choices if you weren't so rude. I guess. With the wings, maybe she'll be light on her feet. There you go. All right, class, let's begin. The mystical mirror of Clunderbuck. Anything with a dual nature that passes through it separates into its two essential selves. Observe the purple orb. Oh. Answer 20 questions, win a date with me. Ow! Pay attention, Thatch. When I went king of the dance, I'll make someone pay attention for me. We're gonna watch you guys dance, then give you some pointers. 
I want you to know that I'm only helping because I want to see Thatch get crushed like an evil stinky bug. <laughs> That's how she dances? Excuse me, I've got to go beg 20 girls to forgive me. That was awful pretty dancing. Not bad, but can you do the mummy hop, the franken twist, and the werewolves? Because that dance seemed a little stiff. Maybe even a little... Don't say it! Wouldn't. <gasps> I can do the vampire stomp. Next. This is terrible. I'll never be Dance King now. So what if you guys don't win? Just have a good time. Rah! Delivery for ya! These thrones have been in our family for centuries. Now we give them to you and your Dance Queen, your proud parents. <sighs> And three and four and I can't look. Whoa! Five minute break. Forget being king. Just make the pain stop. Is it too late to make a suit of armor that looks like a tuxedo? Guys, you're being insensitive. Can't you see she's trying? Harvey, come here. <laughs> Take your starting position and look into Ra's eyes. I wanted to be king just once. You can't quit now. You know, he's under a lot of pressure. Let's work on Harpy's moves. We, the girls of Scare School, refuse to go to the dance with Thatch, signed everyone? Uh -uh. Who needs you? I know where to find the perfect date. You coming? Harpy has tried so hard. She'll make you proud. I don't care how hard she tried. She's hopeless. She could never be a queen. And I'll never be a king. I know you'll do the right thing. A king always does. Oh, please. What do you know about? <laughs> our best. You know, I expected more from Ra. Me too. Being a good king means respecting others. Now where's my date? Ah. Harpy, I'm really sorry. Can you forgive me?
like they're mirror images of each other. Wait a second. It appears we have no choice but to declare a king and queen of the winter chill dance. In your face! <laughs> and the rest of you lose. You lose, and you lose, and hey, you over there, guess what? You lost. That's okay. I'm having a great time. I don't care that we didn't win. Hold it right there. The Mirror of Clunderbuck! You took that from my office! No, sir. Thatch did. Nobody was good enough for him, so he brought himself. <gasps> I can explain! <laughs> Disqualified for cheating! You lose too! <laughs> the real king and queen! <laughs> Great! <laughs>